Hi everyone, I'm back again with another M135i today. It is a later model, 2015, 3 litre petrol, automatic, stage one, mapped, pops and bangs. Yes, it's clear pops and bangs with a resonator delete. Beautiful car, quite nippy versus to the one that I've sold a couple of months ago, which is 2013. Um, in comparison to that one, this is, yeah, it's a bit of a beast. Got a diffuser, M Sport exhaust tips, carbon fiber. Tin pack all around. And lower wheels, black powder coated. Recently, new brake disc and pad all around. Car is detailed, serviced. Comes with the majority of service up to 2019 or 20. The BMW. The rest of them then were done with the um, wrap extra garages. I've got the uh, oil filter housing gasket kit changed. On this one because there was a minor leak on there also changing the thermostat housing gasket there's two pipes which is the cooling pipes going into the oil housing gasket and out from there they were also changed because they were a bit poor LED lights um go. beautiful LED lights that's that's what makes this car stand out as compared to the ones the predecessors All tires front and back are 5mm plus. Got a decal 5D. It's carbon fiber imitation 5D, they call it. Um, look at this brake disc and brake pads. The tires are all branded Bridgestone or Parelli. Brake disc brake pads are very newish. I'm going to give you a bit of a show inside. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. These ones were also changed by the owner. It's kind of um, a standard spec inside. See black seats, no rips or tears on the seats. Not used much. 134,000 miles, not bad uh, for a car of this age. It's been driven mostly on the motorway. A few scratches on the aluminum uh, trimming on the doors, which I think it's quite vulnerable when it comes to aluminum in these cars because it gets scratched very quickly. The back seats are quite newish, um, well not used much. There you go. I mean these ones are much better. I think the other side one is the worst one. Clean car from outside. Um, there's a couple of supermarket dinges here. Yeah, that's the one you can see. Very minor. And there was one here. Uh, yeah, that's the one. You can see that. This one. Uh, there's a little dinge on the back bumper as well. A bit of scratches on the back bumper, but nothing major. Um, it's still in a really good condition. Seat back seats here from this angle too. Looking good. Uh, and this side, what I was mentioning again, this one, I could see scratch and scuff. Oh, let me show you the one which is a bit more worse. Uh, I think that's the one which is gonna, yeah, it's got a scratch there. But yeah, I think I'm not going to change them. I'll leave this for the new owner uh, of this vehicle to go and get them changed to a color, whatever you like. Most people put the red ones on or blue ones on. It's your to your liking from Amazon or from eBay. Um, tires. I mentioned the bodywork gets to you already. Some stone chips on the uh, bonnet and on the front bumper. 
but nothing unusual um, part of the agent mileage package gonna show you a few bits inside and then we're gonna do pops and bangs let me just show you the uh, engine bay first it's getting a bit darker there we go that is the beauty three liter straight turbocharged engine oil filter housing gasket in here this thermostat is gasket which normally doesn't come um, as a kit about it, it was uh, separately ordered from uh, from America to get this replaced because they can get leak over the age or even replace the uh, box belt was changed you can see that's a new pipe and this pipe is also new at the bottom you can see the sticker on it these pipes were changed um, coolant was flushed and placed with the uh, BMW uh, nothing was spared when it comes to getting things changed from this car or whatever I've done. It was general BMW parts. Uh, and just gonna do some uh, inside bits. Uh, just gonna keep the door open. I guess you can see 134,000 miles. Media. It comes with Bluetooth, um, digital radio. Yeah, navigation uh, and uh, all the relevant vehicle information stored in here. Tire pressure monitor. Obviously, when you drive it, will measure it. Oil level is okay. I'm not going to do that. Door open. Uh, I think there's an SOS call function is not working, but I'm going to have a look at that looked before somebody comes and buys that. This car, um, and uh, let's do this. Come with the Sport Plus, Sport Comfort, and Eco mode. So currently it is on Comfort mode. I'm just going to. Pops and bangs. I'm gonna put it on sport. More aggressive. And then it's got sport plus. much it from me uh, hope you like it if you would like to test drive and book the car for viewing please let me know I will uh, be happy to answer any questions for buying